Go ahead, Wilds. Well, I'm going to ask a question. We, what are we doing? What, what do you mean, what are we doing? What are we doing here? I mean, can I say something real quick <laughs> that's going to be unpopular today? Sure. A slight, tiny defense of Russell Westbrook. Oh. He, listen, he has not given up. He was working his ass off on yes, defense. Yes, true. And he had three consecutive excellent defensive possessions down the stretch against Kawhi Leonard. Unfortunately, he is irrevocably broken on offense. And what I say on Wednesday, that this is the worst starting backcourt in the NBA. Might have understated it. Oh, no. Maybe I should have said the worst starting backcourt and backcourt off the bench in the NBA. <laughs> Bro, here's what Russ Beverly and their number one guard off the bench, Kendrick Nunn, did Buckle in yesterday's up. game. Keep in mind, green is good, oh, red is God. bad. That's 24 red X's and one green circle. Starting backcourt's one of 25 from the field. That would be hard to oh, do. Oh, plus it. none. I mean. You couldn't do it. You couldn't <laughs> do it. So, I mean, what do you want? What do you want? Listen, a shockingly, Brew, Rob Belinka maybe made some mistakes this summer. <laughs> you think? But it's and Russ is it's not all on Russ, is my point though. I, I am with you. And 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 I'll give even a bigger defense of Russell Westbrook. Okay. And I'm not saying they shouldn't trade. You guys know I've been saying they should have traded him for who? John Wall. The guy yeah. that came back to a bite ago, them last that. night. Yeah, he was good. I was too. saying last yeah. year. Give up give up Westbrook in that first round pick. For John Wall, 15 points, what, 23 minutes? And, whatever. Some, and some he real burst. Up. And he can run an offense better than Russ. He'll be a role player better than Russ. And that's the problem with Russ. Look, I agree with Westbrook. He was solid last night. Now, LeBron went overboard with great. Here's why he was yeah, solid. Two points. Hold on, say, hold on. I mean, we're, but we're, let, the pendulum has swung But Hold far. on, let me finish. Go for 11. Solid. Nick mentioned the defense, which was great. So, he played with energy. He played with hustle. His defense was good. He missed shots, okay? They want Russ to be a role player. He was a role player. And Russell Westbrook as a role player is never going to shoot well because he's a rhythm guy. He's not a good shooter even when he's in rhythm. But he has to have the ball. He has to be in a rhythm. He has to be a volume shooter. As a role player, he's going to get his 8, 10, 11 shots. He ain't going to shoot well. I'm just telling the Lakers right now, if you want Russell Westbrook to be a role player, you're going to get nights like this. Maybe not 0 for 11, but 2 for 11. A lot of those, he can't shoot. Yeah, and, and, <laughs> and, and Brew, here's the thing. And when you saw it last night, it's not just his missed shots that kill you. It's the way it, him being on the court, particularly him being on the court with Beverly. And if I had to listen to Reggie Miller oh. for one more minute <laughs> and talk about Patrick Beverly like he is the damn Joel Osteen of team motivation <laughs> while he's out there breaking <laughs> shots and, and committing Nick, fouls, I'm going to lose it. Be fair. I'm what? Be fair about what? He's Patrick what? Beverly was a good pickup. No. I'm tell, no. He, he's not good I with Russell be, Westbrook because no. okay, neither listen. one of them gets no. you. I but Beverly, not, yeah, and I'm as, shocked as, that AD as, as and LeBron are listening. I mean, maybe. they. But can I show you some possessions? He's a good pickup, man. Down the stretch, yeah, let's see it. And watch what the defense does to LeBron because they're like, oh, we can just double or triple team you. And watch what happens. This is all when the game is tied or it's a three point game. Show us the first one. Here's the first Russell Westbrook possession. About four and a half minutes left. LeBron gives him the ball. Okay, well, he's wide open. He's like, I probably shouldn't shoot it. And then. It just is a possession <laughs> gone to Ooh, die. I like that one. Next one. That wasn't Next a one. solid. All right, so that's one guard. Here's the other one. LeBron draws the defense. You're wide open. You're terrible, though, so how about the worst floater you'll see all ah! year? And then can we see the last one? Russ, the previous time, was like, all right, I didn't take the open three. They're going to double LeBron. I'm open, and clank, clank. You can't run an offense like this, Wilds. And LeBron... God love him. There's only so much he can do. For years, it was all oh, LeBron on the low block. It's like unguardable. But it was unguardable because if you don't send a double, he'll get to the rim. And if you send a double, he'll find an open shooter. Right. Unfortunately, the open shooters don't exist because the Lakers forgot to sign them this year. Okay. So it's a problem. Yeah. All right. So we talk about two teams a lot on this show. Your Nets and your Lakers. I, I'm not a Laker fan. I know, but they're your Lakers. For, yeah, for the time being. The Nets, Nets are way better. Have a won't problem, right? Steve Nash won't install an offense that's not iso ball. Kyrie won't play enough games. Ben Simmons won't be aggressive enough on offense. The Lakers have a can't problem. 
LeBron can't carry the Lakers like he did 15 years ago. Russ can't thrive in this role. And Kendrick Nunn and Pat Beverly can't make threes. They can't. That's not their calling card. So is this all Rob Polinka's fault, Brew? And if it is, then why did he sign an extension oh, this I heard he makes one month. hell of a Tom Collins over at the Rambo's <laughs> what, what, house. What are we talking about? I mean, he's great at parties. It's all about the... I, the, I mean, what are we... To, what, of I course, what are we talking well, about? The Lakers aren't a serious the, organization. LeBron wanted Russ now, but ultimately, that's on Palinka. Because yes. you, even though LeBron is a, obviously a superstar, you still have to stand your ground. Yes. And if you have to tell your superstar, no, we think this is a better move. Buddy Heald, Russ won't fit. You got to be able to do it. And that was a That's year. That's where Pelinka was a year and a half strong ago. Enough to do it. And he could but and they have, could, Yeah, he. I mentioned John Wall. That's one they could have made. They could have made several. There, there's anything they could. The other thing here's though. Here's the other thing. Because if if you know if Rob Pelinka's defense attorney were here, what he'd be saying, I'm sure, is listen. We're going to trade Russ eventually off the record. However, we're going to wait and see if something better than – we know Turner and Heald are available. We're going to wait and see if something better develops. That's why we haven't done it yet. Now, it might be too late by that time, by the way. So I'm not even sure if that, if that defense record. holds water. But let's say it does. That doesn't justify two straight postseasons of building out a roster as if the three-point line didn't exist, which is what they've done. It is, they have, did, last year they were like, we want old guys. We want old guys that, you know, have been in playoff veterans. battles, savvy veterans. This year they went young, athletic guys. Neither year did they do shooters. The, 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 the kid, what was the last name? Ryan? The kid yeah, who came yeah, in, yeah, he yeah, was yeah. like, oh, I think he might yeah, need to Ryan. start. Yeah, like, they, <laughs> they're hoping he's their Duncan Robinson. Yeah, I mean. But he, look, here's the thing, though. I'm going to put some of this on the players. I don't think mm-hmm. that, maybe Ham, too, the coaching staff. Why, if you can't shoot threes, why Stop are you shooting, shooting so many? Why is Russ taking walk-up threes? They, oh, they are I mean, they're fifth only in the league. And right. a half a game. They're fifth in the league in three-point attempts, like LeBron said after the first game. We're open for Bro. a reason, Bro, <laughs> including were, LeBron. They were, He's shooting too many, too. He's 28% from three. They were 10 of 40 in game one. And in game that two, they good. shot more and made less. <laughs> <Right. game. laughs> They, I mean, what's, you got LeBron and AD who can score in the oh, mid range and the on AD. Foul, get fouls on the not, defense. Stop shooting so many threes. Thanks for watching. Subscribe here to get more from the show and to check out clips from other shows on FS1.